Not impressed. Not impressed at all. I don't want to do this. But you guys have requested it, so... Here we go. Help Wanted, Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. If you haven't seen any of the other YouTubes on this yet, um, I don't know what to say. You'll hear the phone call um, in a sec. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Okay. You oh, oh, oh. Uh, I wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. Um, I actually worked in that office before you. I'm finishing up my last week now, as a matter of fact, so I know it can be a bit overwhelming, but I'm here to tell you there's nothing to worry about. Liar. Fine. So let's just focus on getting you through your first week, okay? Uh, let's see. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company that I'm supposed to read. It's kind of a legal thing, you know. Um, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike. I hate you. fantasy and fun come to life. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or a person. Upon discovering that damage or death have occurred, a missing person report will be filed within 90 days or as soon as property and premises have been thoroughly cleaned and bleached and the carpets have been replaced. Blah, blah, blah. Now, that That's might disgusting. sound bad, I know, but there's really nothing to worry about. Uh, the animatronic characters here do get a bit quirky at night, but do I blame them? No. If I were forced to sing those same stupid yeah, songs are. for 20 years and I never got a bath, I'd probably be a bit irritable at night, too. So remember, They're just creepy. these characters hold a special place in the hearts of children, and we need to show them a little respect, right? Okay. So just be aware, the characters do tend to wander a bit. Uh, they're left in some kind of free-roaming mode at night. Uh, something about their servos locking up if they get turned off for too long. Uh, they used to be allowed to walk around during the day, too. But then there was the bite of 87. Yeah, it's amazing that the human body can live without the frontal lobe, you know? Uh, now, really? concerning your safety, the only real risk to you as a night watchman here, if any, is the fact that these characters, uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume on it. Now, since that's against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, They'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. Um, now, that wouldn't be so bad if the suits themselves weren't filled with cross beams, wired, animatronic devices, especially around the facial area. So you can imagine how having your head forcefully pressed inside one of those could cause a bit of discomfort. That's horrible. And death. Uh, the only parts of you that would like Did he just to say a bit of discomfort and death? pop out the front of the mask <laughs> Yeah, they don't tell you these things when you sign up. But hey, first day should be a breeze. I'll chat with you tomorrow. Uh, check those cameras and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. <sighs> Gotta conserve power. Alright, good night. I hate you. I hate you all. So, you would have gotten basically from uh, that phone conversation there. You're stuck in this room. You don't get to move. Um, your power down here. Oh, shit. Okay, so the bunny's already gone. There he is. All right. So the more you use something, including closing the doors or looking at your cameras, the more power that gets um, used up. And if you've got no power, the, the doors stay open. There's, you, they just stay open, and you're stuffed basically. Oh, I don't like that. Good, he's still there. How are the other ones though? Still there. Okay. So, yeah, I'm gonna get my eat. Uh, my eat, my eat face. Oh my god! I'm not scared at all. If you guys saw me playing the um, the Minecraft horror map, the orphanage, 
I was a little disappointed because it didn't really scare me so much. Um, and this first day is supposed to be fairly cruisy. I mean, it's 3 a.m. now. Still got 70% of my power left. There's the bunny still there, so they're still at the other end of the um, of the restaurant. 69%. See, it's that creepy music. It's the anticipation of nothing happening that makes it scarier. I'm, I, for your sake, guys, I'm really hoping that this does scare me. Um, still there. Oh, crap. Now they've gone. Where's the other one? Don't tell me he's close already. Let's just check around me. No, no. No and no. Dum dum diddy dum dum dum. Dudes, come on, it's 3 a.m. Where is he? Not there. Not there. Oh, far out, man. Maybe. No, because I can still hear him. Bunny's still there. Bear's still there. The duck I'm missing. Don't like this. 4 a.m. 53%. All right, bears moving. Is there something there? It's totally gonna eat my face. Turn off. 48% 4 a.m. Come on, man. If I can't see them. Camera disabled. Awesome. Turn off. Oh, hello. Okay, so he's getting close. Where's the other one, though? Ah, good. He's there. He's there. So it's you. It's you, ducky deer. Oh, far out, man. 5am. 39%. Ducky poos! He's gonna... He's gonna... Come on, dude. Not long to go. I've got plenty of power. I could just close the doors. It's, go it's got to be coming up on the right-hand side. Come on, man. I'm in my last hour. In the home stretch. <sighs> I hate you guys. Have I said that yet? Come on. Ha ha ha. There you go. Night one complete. I hope you've enjoyed it. We made it. See you in night two.